So today I am going to present to you a collective weekly reading. So let's see how your coming week is going to be. This is Shikla Sapan Madre. Welcome to my channel. So let's see the start of the week, mid of the week and end of the week. All right. Let's see what you need to surrender. I'm hearing surrender your fears. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. Let's see message regarding what changes are coming in your life. Love life. Okay. Let's see your financial message. a message from a departed loved one I'm hearing I'll always love you that's what I'm hearing it looks like you're written something to them or something written is what I'm getting please note these are general readings so take what resonates leave what does not message regarding your career health message I'm hearing some sort of infection you're having it could be stomach or something else okay let's see your cards the beginning of the week all right the beginning of the week is going to be full of temptations do not fall for it ensure that you are following the right path and ignoring anything which is taking you away from what is right all right and um, you know many people ask me so what is right how do you know what is right well if anything that is not harming anyone and is for your highest good is right okay that could be one of the ways of looking at it so don't fall into temptations keep your path clear also ensure that you are protecting your uh, your stuff all right you got eight of wands so things are going to go in super speed on Wednesday and Thursday some of you are going to travel uh, some of you are going to receive some courier or pending messages but things are going to be super fast all right so be braced up for this quick movement the end of the week Friday Saturday Sunday is ten of cups which means you're going to spend really good quality time with your family there could be a family dinner or a family or a house party happening uh, you may also go on a picnic or something or travel with your family you know with the eight of wands and the ten of cups some of you would literally be traveling with your family uh, also for some of you there could be an addition in the family via birth of a child or marriage in your or extended family all right let's see your other cards stay positive so uh, whatever your health worries are do see a doctor get proper medication however ensure that you have a positive mindset okay uh, be positive and trust the process time to decide so whether you are a homemaker or a corporate career person or you are into business you need to take some decisions which are going to take you closer towards what you want to manifest so ensure that you are not delaying it I also feel that some of you are going to do a lot of financial planning all right during this week is what I'm hearing let's see your self-care message deep breathing you know when we are anxious our breathing gets really short so taking deep breath can really help you to relax and unwind so do our deep breathing exercises uh, that can definitely help you do not go overboard 
Now, a message from a departed loved one is that it was their time to go and there was nothing that you could do it to stop it from happening, though you tried your best. Also, they are saying, you know, that they are with you uh, and, you know, there is an element of them in you which is still on and even after them moving on, you did a lot of prayers and rituals for their mental peace some of it did charity for them so they appreciate all of that okay face your financial fears so you know uh, i always tell this many people say oh don't think negative oh don't uh, give energy to negative thoughts I do agree with them partially that yes, we are not supposed to give energy to negative thoughts or fears, but it's always best to face those fears. For example, if you have this fear, I may go bankrupt. Okay, so tell yourself, did I go bankrupt till now? No. Uh, has money showed up whenever I needed it? Yes. What can I do to? To ensure that I do not go bankrupt, save, spend less, uh, make proper investments. Okay, I'll do that. This way you are kind of, you know, our brain is designed to fight or flight. So if your brain is trying to come up with a situation of, of worry or fear, you know, face it by saying, okay, guess if this happens, then what? For example, you are you are like you are worried about your plane crashing. Tell yourself, you know what? It rarely happens, so it may not happen to me because I think you know uh, I'm I'm just protected enough. I'm taking the best possible airlines. Uh, or if you before traveling, if you have that fear, oh my God, what if the plane crashes? Do one thing. Book the best airline so that you are safe. Do proper prayers. So whatever it is that you fear, okay, the best way is to face it. Think, okay, if whatever I'm afraid of happens to be true, what do I do? And that way, you're taking the energy away from fear. Fear feels, oh my God, this person has already come up with a solution. Now here what I'm saying is don't spend days and months together facing your financial fear or any kind of fear just give 30 seconds to it you know okay this is the way okay fine this is what i'm afraid of all right this is what i can do if it happens that's it all right you can also try frustration magic which is uh, there on my channel that can definitely help love message friendship nurture the bond of friendship within your relationship and your love lo and your love life will dramatically improve I always feel two people are really good friends before they enter into a relationship and at times when it becomes difficult to be in a relationship or uh, to just you know be with each other just tell each other you know what let's do what we used to do before okay let's talk to each other I know it sounds simple than you know doing it actually but one can always take baby steps. If you're single, there's a high probability that somebody who is your friend may propose you or uh, you may meet somebody via a friend as well. Finances. So this week, finances are going to change. Lot of... Uh, so that, you know, uh, do not fall into temptation okay and if you get any fraud calls from anyone asking for your otp pin do not give it to them or right, ensure that you're keeping your money safe surrender your fear of intimacy you are ready to let love in compassionately identify and begin to release any patterns that stop you from opening your heart now this is uh, you know um, surrender your fear of intimacy also could obviously in we know what it means as it means but at times we, we are very scared to let new people come in our lives uh, if you already have like you know we have been disappointed by friends before we would be wary of making new friends we would always stick with our old friends or, or always stick to with family so that you know we don't we do not get betrayed 
all right so open your heart is what this card is also trying to tell you all right now let's see what blessings are coming your way so i'm going to remove three cards for blessings seven chakra archangel you oh door to value all right that's beautiful so first archangel gabriel fifth chakra which means you are going to uh, communicate more clearly with people around you and you're going to present more facts and data which is going to help you you got door to value which means a lot of new doors are going to open to you which are going to add a lot of financial value to your life so it could be an idea that may come through you come to you or it could be somebody walking up to you and telling you hey why why don't you apply at this this place you got seven chakra archangel uriel which means lot of downloads you are going to receive via dreams via visions ideas are going to come to you so pay attention to that as that's going to help you in the long run now let's see what your yellow card messages are telling us okay let's see your card number 1 finding what is lost so what have you lost a material object or uh something you know which was very close to your heart you are going to find that something about it ideas and intuition look seven chakra archangel uriel and you got ideas and intuitions a lot of ideas are going to come your way your intuition is going to guide you so listen to it do not ignore it take action so what this door of value is going to open if you take action so ensure that you are taking action so that when this door to value opens up you walk through it all right now let's see what you, what your charms are telling us okay you got stars over here and you got the moon and star over here let's see no matter where no matter where you are in your life right now you are going to reach the moon and the stars okay you're going to really reach great heights so do not worry do not feel overwhelmed do not feel frustrated frustrated with with wherever you are right now all right now let me remove the wheel of fortune think about a question and let me spin the wheel for you you got better So whatever you ask for the answer will the answer from the divine is you're going to get better. So if you're asked for a 1000 square feet home you're going to get a 1500 square feet home or a 1000 square feet home in a very beautiful area full of prosperity and abundance. So this is what better is. So take care guys. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Take care. Bye bye. Mm -hmm.